Hello chatbooks out there, today in this vlog I'm going to be telling you guys all about what I got to on my week so far, so that's my Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of this week. I hope you guys are all doing well. First of all, I just want to say I cannot believe we're in October already, it's spooky season. I've just been watching lots of Halloween films, I watched Sleepy Hollow the other day with a young Johnny Depp, his jawline, wow, he's just gorgeous. And also watched Hocus Pocus the first one and the second one is so good as well and watched Halloween Town such classic films and I also watched The Allen Family with Nicole Witchie and Angelica Houston love those films so much and I decorated my dollhouse for Halloween already as you guys know I themed my dollhouse for Christmas, Halloween, Easter and other themes like that and I'm going to show you guys a photo of the dollhouse decorated for Halloween now. It's so beautiful. I love my dollhouse decorated for Christmas. The ghost and the pumpkin on the porch is just so adorable. Then on my Monday, I had work. I was supposed to have Monday off and then work Tuesday evening and then have Wednesday, Thursday off. But I covered for one of my colleagues who had broken her finger at football and had to go to the doctors on Monday to have that scan to see if she needed to have an operation on it. So she did my Tuesday evening instead, which meant I get Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday off. And so I worked Monday doing 10 to three. So I got up ready for work, had some breakfast. My dad, older brother, sister, and younger brother were already at work. Younger sister was in uni and my mum was asleep. I locked up and made my way to work. On the way to work, I got a beautiful little flower snap that I'm going to show you guys now. It's so pretty. I then got up to the high street and I was up there a little bit early. So I went off and got myself a drink from the corner shop and then went and had a look around the charge shops. And I got this Bambi pop figure, which is so cute. Box a little bit battered, but love it then i got to work and i got clocked in and i was cleaning tables doing food and doing orders and bill taking and chatted to some of the regulars and one of my colleagues who was on shift had to go off home sick so it was just me on floor and one of a colleague on bar luckily our manager was in out the back of his day off doing some work on a laptop so he came and helped out whilst it was busy and then when it quieted down he went off home and then about one-ish it got really busy again and I was wanting food and drinks, cleaning tables, doing food and drink orders, doing quite a lot of the food and drink orders myself and the food and drink, food and drink tickets didn't print properly so I had to sort that out and by three o'clock I was actually just so done, I was so ready to have these three days off and some of the colleagues who were finishing as well Stayed and we had some drinks. I had two Tom Collins, a luxury hot chocolate, and some halloumi fries, and they were so good. I then clocked off, got my bag and coat, and my dad picked me up. We got home, and I watched Harley Quinn and Home and Away, wrote a bit of my journal, listened to a bit of music. My older brother got back from being at work, and then we, he went off to the web club to use the gym. And then my younger sister and her boyfriend came over and she's down to stay the night and she was going to watch me, my older sister and her boyfriend play rugby and then we got ready for touch rugby and me, my younger sister and her boyfriend went off to touch rugby, got to touch rugby and it was a really good evening, I did some really good running and passing, had my knee bandaged just in case I knocked the scab and made my knee bleed again because it always fall onto my knees but this time however I was doing really well, we had a lot of water break and my younger sister stupidly said Hey yeah, Dan, I'm surprised you haven't fallen over yet and I was like, you jinxed it now and within 10 minutes of going back on the pitch I managed to fall over, not on my knees this time, on my back I literally slipped because it was quite wet and damp on the grass and landed on my back, it was hilarious and my older sister literally just could not stop laughing and then after the session we then went off to Tesco's to get some snacks as me and my sisters were going back to my older sister's house to have a little film night. My younger sister's boyfriend 
took us to get some snacks from Tesco's and then dropped us down to my older sister's house. He then went off to the pub with his mates. I had brought my spare change of clothes and my journal to white while I was watching the film. And so I got showered and changed, wrote my journal, had some of my snacks and we watched the Cinderella with Camilla, Camilla, can't say her name, Camilla Cabello in. And it's quite a good film, the songs were really good. And then my mum came and picked us up and whilst at my oldest house, I got a plant snap of some plants hanging above on the ceiling, which is so pretty that I'm going to show you guys now. I love her house, it's so pretty with lots of plants. I also got a photo of some lovely flowers on her coffee table in the living room that I'm going to show you guys now as well. such beautiful colours, flowers. Also got a snap of her cat, Laufey. She has two, one's called Laufey and one is called Loki. Loki is a lockdown cat and he does not like humans. He only likes my sister, everyone else he does not like. And Laufey is not a lockdown cat and he loves affection and always likes to be picked up and talks to you, he meows at you a lot. And yeah, I'm gonna show you guys a photo of that now. They are so adorable. I'm also going to quickly show you a photo of my cat I got early on, and she's so adorable. I call her my little tiger. I'm going to show you guys that now. Love my cat Birdie. She's so cute, but she can be a bit of a baggage. And when her eyes get black, it means she's in killer mode. And I'm like, okay, put you down. Me and my mum and my young sister then got home and I got into my PJs and I watched the UK Six, wrote a bit of my journal, listened to a bit of music, had some cereal and then I went off to bed and then on my Tuesday I got up after a nice lion and I then had a shower, got changed, had some breakfast and was just listening to a bit of music. My dad, older sister and brother and younger brother were at work my younger sister was getting ready to go off back to uni. Her boyfriend was dropping her back and my mum was up and she was just watching a bit of TV. And then I was just listening to a bit of music, playing on Pokemon Go, watching TikTok. And then my younger sister and her boyfriend went off to go to Hawks to have some food. And they kindly dropped me up near there to get my hair cut. That's the barbers I go to, it's just up from there and I got my hair cut, love it. The barber does such a great job and she also gave my beard a bit of a trim. I then went and had a look around the child shops and popped into my workplace to see my sister and her boyfriend and they said how they liked my haircut, bless them. And I got a selfie in front of some nice autumnal geese showing off the new do. And also went off and got this new doll here. Love the pearl necklace and the earrings. And then I went off to the garden centre in the high street and uh, I got some plant photography from there that I'm going to show you guys now. It's so lovely in there. I love the plant photography so much, the lovely colours, the patterns, just amazing. I then got some flower photography from there that I'm going to show you guys now as well. so great and that one of the ladies that runs the garden center actually follows me on instagram and always says how she looks forward to seeing my flower photography bless her then i went off to one of the flower shops and i got a autumnal display snap and they have these adorable pumpkin plant pots and this beautiful weave 
And I'm gonna show you guys a photo of that now. It's so pretty. Then I went inside of the flower shop and got a load of flower photography that I'm gonna show you guys now. After that, I then went off to one of my favorite old coffee shops and got a luxury hot chocolate from there that I'm gonna show you guys now. It was so delicious. I then stayed in there for a little bit and had a chat with the ones working in there and it was so lovely. I then made my way home. On the way back, I was playing on Pokemon Go and I got this rose snap that I'm gonna show you guys now. I love roses so much. I then saw a girl I went to school with who was walking her dog, so I was just having a nice chat with her. I then got home, showed my mum the new dog that I got. She's just so stunning, love her, love the pearl necks and the earrings. And I picked my cat up and was stroking my cat, and then they knocked off the doll who was on the arm of the chair, causing her head to fall off. So of course, she had to have an emergency operation to get her head put back on and I then got a photo of her. I then had my lunch. I had a cheese toasty and a cup of tea and then ended up having a little bit of a nap because I've got a little bit of a cold, a little bunged up. So I was feeling a little bit grisly, let's just say, and not in the best of moods. Got up and was feeling nice and refreshed, a lot more human. And then I watched Home and Away and Escape to Country and Garden Rescue. And then for tea, we had a fry up tea that I'm gonna show you guys a photo of now. Can't beat a fry up, it was so delicious. I then watched the UK Soaps and it's Emmerdale's 50th birthday. Happy birthday, Emmerdale. Such a great show. And it's a big week, there's a storm of brewing, so I cannot wait. And then I was just listening to a bit of music, just enjoying it and colouring in and I watched 13 Going On 30, love that film. I think I am a little bit obsessed with Mark Ruffalo. He is just such a hunk. Then I went off to bed and on my Wednesday, which is today, I got up early so not to sleep the day away and I got showered and changed, had some breakfast, just listened to a bit of music, was doing a bit of drawing and coming in. My dad, older brother, sister and younger brother were at work, younger sister back in uni and my mum and myself were just watching a bit of TV. My dad got back from work and he went off to bed. I then was just listening to a bit of the 80s and 90s music channel. Then I got myself ready and I went off on a massive walk and got some flower photography that I'm gonna show you guys now. I also got a really cute black and white selfie on this little wooden fridge. And yeah, I just love it. Can't miss a selfie opportunity. Then I went and got myself some lunch and on the way back, I got these two beautiful roast snaps that I'm gonna show you guys now. They are absolutely stunning. I also got this other flower snap and it's just so pretty. And I'm gonna show you guys a photo of that now. I just love flower photography so much, it makes me so happy. I then got home and my mum and dad were getting ready to go off to the hospital for my mum's doctor's checkup. And they went off there. I then had my lunch and I watched a bit of TV this bit of music and I got myself some Jelly Babies from the shops while getting my lunch. Love Jelly Babies. And then 
had my lunch, I had a cup of tea and had ham and cheese sandwiches and these cheese dunk things with little like biscuit sticks that you just dunk in the cheese and also got myself a Belgian bun so I had that with a cup of tea and I'm going to show you guys a photo of that now. It was so delicious, love a Belgian bun, always have the cherry last because that's my favourite bit. Then I watched Home and Away, just a bit of music, just of drawing and colouring in and my mum and dad are now back, my older brother's back from being at work and I watched Garden Rescue and Escape to the Country, saw so I my Bluetooth doll and my dad is just sorting out his fishing stuff as he goes fishing on Thursdays so he's getting that ready for tomorrow and I then was just watching a bit of Netflix doing some new illustrations, a little bit of colouring in, a bit of writing and my dad was getting stuff ready for tea, we're having spaghetti bolognese and it literally smells so good and I then was just doing some new illustrations and colouring in and a little bit of work on this new book that I'm working on at the moment, a little short story and I watched a bit of Heartstopper and a bit of Young Royals and need to start the new Heartstopper third book out of four I've read two so far and yeah I just love Heartstopper so much. Then I had a little bit of a nap and falling asleep and yeah I was absolutely knackered and had a bit of a headache, got up and felt a lot better and then I had my tea. I had spaghetti bolognese with lots of parmesan cheese and I'm going to show you guys a photo of that now. It was so delicious. I love spaghetti bolognese so much. I love it with lots of parmesan cheese. It's the best way piled high with parmesan cheese. And then I was just watching last night's Bake Off as I had forgotten to watch that. It was dessert week and I had that with a cup of tea and a donut and yeah I just love Bake Off so much and yeah I'm now off to go and watch the UK States from this evening and then probably just gonna chill watch a bit more Netflix then tomorrow I'm going off for lunch with my grandma and grandpa and my mum and my dad is fishing then I'm probably gonna head off and have a look, have a look around the flower shops We'll get some more flower and plant photography, maybe pop to one of the coffee shops and just chill. And then I'm back to work Friday for a split shift and then back in on Saturday evening for a evening shift. And my younger brother's girlfriend has invited me to go off to the garden centre with them to get some Christmas decorations as my younger brother's girlfriend is already thinking about Christmas, getting it all Christmassy in their first flat together and so I'm going to go off there and help them get some decorations with that and yeah looking forward to that hope you guys all have a lovely rest of your week all have a lovely rest of your Wednesday and I shall see you with a new vlog coming very soon hope you've enjoyed the vlog please like comment and subscribe and I shall see you very soon bye